Hello everyone, this is Celia from Cisco Tech. In this video, I will show you how to perform a password recovery on a Catalyst 9000 switch stack. If your network is live, ensure that you understand the potential impact of the password recovery procedure as it will require a reload of the switch. First, we will go through the password recovery steps for a standard stack-wise setup. Turn off all the members of the stack and leave only the active switch on. Otherwise, the configuration will be transferred to the standby switch and the password recovery will not be successful. Now, power cycle the active switch. If you see the following prompt, press Ctrl-C to enter into remote mode. If you don't see this prompt, press the mode button repeatedly until you see the following prompt. Use the set command to see the remote variables. The switch disable password recovery variable should be set to zero. Change switch ignore startup config to one to bypass the startup configuration. Now, boot the switch using the boot command. Once the switch boot completes, there is no configuration on the switch. Now you can access the switch. Copy the startup configuration to the running configuration to restore the previous settings. Next, set your new password. Reset the switch ignore startup config variable back to zero with the following command to ensure the switch retains the configuration of future reloads. Now, save your configuration. Verify the switch ignore startup config variable is set to zero using the following command. Now, you can power on the rest of the switches in the stack. For a stack-wise virtual setup, start by turning off the standby switch and power cycling the active switch. When you see the following prompt, press Ctrl-C. Once in Roman, use the set command to see the Roman variables. The switch ignore startup config variable should be set to zero. We need to change this variable to 1. Now, boot the switch using the boot command. Now, you can access the switch. Notice that the stackwise virtual configuration remains since it is stored in the dstack roman variables. Hence, no additional reload is needed for this configuration to take effect. Now, you need to copy the startup configuration back to the running configuration. Then, set your new password. Now, we need to set the switch ignore startup configuration variable back to zero. Use the following command. Now, save your configuration. Verify the switch ignore startup config is set to zero using the following command. Now you can power on the standby switch. You have now learned how to perform a password recovery on a Catalyst 9000 switch stack. Check the Tarpedia portal for more content. Thanks for watching.